Visual X Masterclass, I want us to move on with this problem. With this exam, it was in November 2012, it was question 10. Uh, make sure that you read the statement and you label your diagram. In this particular case, we're also told that WS, WS is to SP, 3 is to 2. 3 is to 2. Make sure that you put it correct, not the other way around. This is also what you are given, RT 6 centimeters. The first question is calculate WT. Let's find WT. Where is WT? WT is here. There are a number of parallel lines. Whenever we see parallel lines, think of the proportionality theorem. A line drawn parallel to one side of a, of a, a triangle divides the other two sides proportionally. So that's the key. It's all about theorems. It's either we deal with proportionality theorem or similarity theorem. In this particular case, let's look at our W. Uh, we're looking for WT, WT. Now watch here. There is a triangle here. This is the triangle that I want us to look at. This triangle. When you look at this triangle, there is a line that is drawn parallel to one. I'm just trying to locate the theorem. What do I know? A line drawn parallel to one side of a triangle divides the other two sides proportionally. In other words, this over that is equal to that over that. That's all that is being asked here when we're required to find WT. It is advisable that you start with what you are looking for. In this case, we're looking for WT. So using the, in this triangle, I'm going to write in the triangle uh, PRW. Then I will then say WT, what we're looking for. WT, this over that over RT. This over that is equal to that over that, which is WS. WS over SP over SP. What is it that I'm, 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 I've applied here? I've applied what to refer to it as the proportionality theorem. In other words, I'm, 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 I'm avoiding to write the whole theorem, I just say proportionality theorem. But I know what the theorem says. It says a line drawn parallel to one side of a triangle divides the other two sides proportionally. That's what I've written here. What is it that we're looking for here? We're looking for WT. So WT, we must make it the subject. That's why your grade 8, grade 9 comes in handy. So my WT will be equal to cross multiply. It will be RT times WS over SP. Right, I've just manipula manipulated my formula and make WT the subject because that's what I'm looking for. Then, hence, WT will be equal to. Do I see anything on RT? RT, I see 6, you push it in there, times. WS, what do I see in WS? I see 3. Over SP, what do I see in SP? I see 2. Right, therefore, WT will be equal to uh, 6 times 3 is 18, uh, and this one is, okay, 2 into 6 goes 3 times 3 times 3 is 9, so it's 9 centimeter. That becomes important, that WT is 9 centimeters. Right, that's how you go about finding this. Oh, yeah, six, with six times three, it's 18. 18 divided by two is nine, so we're correct. That's how we go about finding WT. Number two, calculate WQ. Well, what, we're looking for WQ now. Where is WQ? Oh, this whole distance. In other words, we're short of this one. Okay. Uh, let, me, let me look at it. I'm trying to look the, at the triangle that we're going to use. We're looking for Q, WQ, WQ, this whole distance. This is nine, this is six, 15, we're short of this one. Okay, that's too many ways. If I'm looking for, wait, 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 let me see which triangle to use. If I use this triangle, this bigger triangle, I will have this over this equals to that over that, yeah, that's the triangle. Let me just highlight the triangle that I'll be using. I'll be using this bigger triangle. This bigger triangle, this bigger triangle. That's the triangle that I'll be using. Which parallel lines will I be using? Because I'm looking for the bigger one. Which triangles, I can't be using this one because, okay, I've got to use this, this, this parallel lines. These lines are parallel, these two lines are parallel. 
So it's that over that is equal to that over that. Or it's that over this equal to that over this one. Right. I will use option two because I'm looking for WQ. WQ, that's what we're looking for. WQ. We know that if if I've in this triangle, I've got to indicate that I'm using the bigger triangle, then WQ Q WQ over WR is equal to we set WQ WQ over WR. Remember these are the parallel lines that I'm using. WP WP over WS. What did I use here? I use proportionality theorem. What is it that I'm looking for here? I'm looking for WQ. I've got to make it the subject of my formula. WQ, I cross multiply. So my WQ will be equals to WR times WP over WS. Just manipulated my formula. Now watch. WQ will then be equals to. Let's let me check. Do I see anything on WR? Where is WR? WR, how many units are this? 9 got 6, it's 15 times WP. WP, where is WP? WP, that's what I'm seeing there, 3 and 2, it's 5. Over WS, what do I see on WS? WS, I see 3. So this would be equals to 3 into 15, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. It's 5, 5 times 5, it's 25. 25 centimeters. There are two ways of doing this problem. I would have found this one first, which is QR, and add uh, RW to get the same value, which is 25. Thank you.